Born in Cleveland, Ohio in 1942, Paul Kaminsky graduated from John Marshall High School in 1960, receiving a BS degree in engineering science from the Air Force Academy in 1964. Paul earned his MS degrees in aeronautics and astronautics, and in electrical engineering from MIT in 1966, and a PhD from Stanford University in aeronautics and astronautics. Paul served 20 years on active duty in the U.S. Air Force, mostly within Air Force Systems Command, rising to the rank of full colonel. Among other Air Force assignments, he was responsible for testing and evaluating inertial guidance components for the LGM-30 Minuteman missile and terminal guidance systems for the first U.S. precision-guided munitions. In 1971, Paul was assigned to the National Reconnaissance Office based in Los Angeles. There, he led work on space system and related unconventional imaging technology, including the flying of prototypes on low and high altitude aircraft. In 1976 to 1977, Paul attended the Industrial College of the Armed Forces. He also became special assistant for the Under Secretary of Defense, William Perry. One of his assignments was to assess early work on stealth technology. Paul recommended going ahead with the creation of a large program that included expanding the experimental HAV Blue airplane, precursor of the F-117A Nighthawk. Paul became director for Low Observables Technology in 1981, with the responsibility for overseeing the development, production, and fielding of major stealth aircraft systems, such as the F-117 and Northrop Grumman B-2 Spirit, along with an advanced stealthy cruise missile and other programs. Paul left the Air Force after 20 years of service in 1984. During that time, he is credited with directing groundbreaking aerospace programs and processes, such as the first precision-guided munitions. This enabled and contributed to the success of hundreds of weapon systems and the resulting byproducts. Paul is widely known as the first leader and developer of U.S. stealth technology. For these achievements, Paul has been recognized and commended by U.S. presidents, high technology officials, and many professional organizations. Tonight, we welcome aerospace innovator Paul Kaminsky to the National Aviation Hall of Fame.